Uh, this is the um, unboxing review of the Jaguar Firecat 175 pounds recurve crossbow. Um, I ordered it from Blades and Bows, fantastic company. It came the next day. Um, I was a bit surprised when I saw the wooden stock because I'd actually ordered the black ABS. Um, but when I realised it's, it's just the same packaging they use for um, all their crossbows, whether they're um, the wooden stock um, or the uh, moulded ABS um, stock. So it didn't make a difference. They do. £40, £80, £105, £115, £175 pounds pound bows um, from the Jaguar range. Um, this one's £175 pounds, and I say it's a black synthetic stock um, and when you open it up you can see um, that's exactly what's inside. Like I said I got it from uh, Blades and Bows. They've got a large selection uh, of crossbows on there. Um, you wouldn't believe it, this costs £49.99. Pounds pence. So extremely good value for money. Um, I had previously had a, uh, a Lynx Magnum, um, which was a £150 uh, draw weight wooden stock crossbow, very similar to the Jaguar, um, also from China. I sold it a while ago and I missed it, so I have been on the lookout for a new crossbow. And when this came out at this price, £49.99, it just, you know, I couldn't give it a miss. Um, so, unboxing. Got some instructions here. Uh, on how to put it together. Um, a bit later on I'll show you how it does go together. Okay. And this is a, a nice change. You've actually got a, a proper stringing um, tool with this. Um, so it's the right way around. Um, they, previously it was quite difficult to string on your own but they have got a new stringing tool that comes with it. Um, and we'll see how, how good that works, that's the instructions for that. The crossbow comes with uh, three bolts, uh, nice big um, fletchings. Um, I have ordered some more. And here's your recurve limb, branded Armex. Um, it's £175 uh, recurve limb. Quite a lightweight, but the actual stock is wood, sorry, is um, metal and black ABS, so that's quite heavy, so I'm glad that's lighter, keep the front end lighter. The stock itself, like I say, it's ABS um, stock here. This is all aluminium alloy frame, um, including the arrow rail, very solid, very heavy. It's got a, a, an ABS grip here. Um, it's got a 20mm um, weaver rail here, um, and that just keeps your arrow um, fixed to the, to the rail. What I like with this, if you can see, you can do some very quick adjustments and it resets back um, to the uh, straight position. Reason being with crossbows, whilst they've got initial high power, like I say 175 pound draw weight, which is about 245 feet per second, that's very powerful. Um, you'd never draw a 175 pound bow by hand, um, but the downside is because it's only a short draw um, length and the bolts are only 16 inches long, unlike a bow, um, these do drop um, at a short distance. So with a bow you can shoot up to 100 yards and, and still hit the target. With a crossbow, you will see a much sharper drop incline um, over distance. So up to sort of like 50 yards, 60 yards, you can significantly drop off target. With this, this will compensate massive adjustments to compensate. As this comes down, obviously the bow's coming up, which means you can sight it in at some quite high distances. So that's a, a good addition um, to this. It has got a safety. Um, when I put it all together I'll show you how that works. So I really like the stock. It looks nice and tactical in black. Um, they do it in camouflage as well. It's a little bit more for camouflage. But I don't want to waste money. £49, I don't care if it's um, black or, or camo. Um, what I've got to point out is Blades and Bows, they, they do um, check the contents um, before shipping. Um, so you can see, you know, they don't just send it out um, once they've had them shipped in the country, they do actually open them up and physically check the contents 
uh, for quality control. We've got a stirrup here. I'll fit that as well. And you've got your bits and pieces here for, for your limb, uh, for your limb ends, allen keys, various screws. Um, that's your front sight if you want to keep open sights. I'm planning on putting a um, telescopic sight on it. And this is uh, what I was talking about with the um, stringing tool. That's the stringing tool there. Um, that's the actual bow string. And I'll show you how that um, works in a little while. I've not tried it before. So I'll be interested to do it first here, straight off. So like I say, that's the uh, stock, very nice. ABS and um, moulded um, aluminium alloy frame. We've got a fiberglass limb, 175 pound draw weight, a foot uh, stirrup, and uh, three, three arrows. Okay, let's put it together.